Good morning. Happy Saturday to you, at least it's Saturday for me. We're getting out on the lake this morning. We are fishing the lake where the Bassmaster Classic is going to be fished in 2025, and that is Lake Ray Roberts. I would consider this my home lake between here and Lake Louisville. Uh, I've caught some pretty big fish before here. My biggest is probably, actually I didn't have my scale uh, the day I caught probably the biggest fish here. It was probably pushing eight pounds, I'm guessing. Uh, officially though, my biggest is six and a half that I have weighed, but that one was definitely closer to eight. Anyways, I'm rambling. Point being this morning, we're gonna get out and try to catch a double digit bass, all right? I've got a challenge that if I catch a double digit bass, someone is gonna pay me $5,000. All right, $5,000 on the line for a double digit. Uh, that is my goal. That would also be my PB overall, like ever. So that's what we're gonna shoot for today. I have no clue if they're up shallow. I have no clue if they're spawning, if they're still deeper. I haven't been to this lake in about a month, month and a half. So I'm not really sure what the pattern's gonna be. We've only got about three hours to figure it out before I gotta get back to some kids' ball games. Uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna send it. We're gonna see what we can find. It's a uh, early spring morning, it's cold. Uh, it's like 45 degrees, but uh, we'll see what the water temp is and see if we can find where these fish are located. Let's go. probably two hours on the south side of the lake and got nothing came up here to the north side water temps about two degrees warmer and at least got one small one the fat little chunker but that's a good sign of uh, hopefully more fish to come uh, now that i've kind of dialed in at least one fish i won't call it a pattern yet but at least one fish so far getting a little bigger now got that one on the uh, straight king popping perch I actually looked away because I heard something splash over there saw a boat driving up and uh, looked back and my frog was gone literally I could see the fish swimming off with it it's so shallow but uh, that's a pretty pretty good one there upgrading let's go they're up shallow let's go three also on the striking pop and perch unfortunately these are all males all small males but that one absolutely destroyed it my goodness well <clears throat> we did not catch a 10 pounder we did catch three fish missed a fourth one they were all small mills though. I was afraid of that. I was afraid I'd be about a week too soon on Ray Roberts uh, for the spawn. I did see four or five pretty big females though, just kind of cruising around. They weren't locked in on beds. Uh, the challenge though, sorry, I'm eating some uh, righteous felon uh, beef jerky. By the way, this one's a street taco. Uh, I would highly recommend this one. It's really good. But anyways, the $5,000 10 pound or larger bass challenge 
Uh, I'll just have to wait and hopefully tell you about it next video. I'm going to come back out here in the next week or so back to Ray Roberts because, uh, man, I want to catch a double digit from this lake. And uh, during the spawn is the time to do it. So stay tuned. Next week, we're going to hit it again. But for now, had some fun catching on the frog today. That uh, Strike King Poppin' Perch, that's a good one. Uh, the white color just seems to get it done. It is so soft, easy hookups. Uh, even on the small guys that I caught today. So anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. If nobody told Jake, I loves you and so do I. Until next time, peace.